Good morning, meteorologist Amanda Pappas here. Welcome back to 10 Tampa Bay this morning. Happy Election Day. And I know, yes, it's Election Day. It's November and we're still talking tropics. I know you're stick, sick of it and have some hurricane fatigue probably, but I have some good news this morning. Tropical Storm Rafael from the National Hurricane Center. Latest advisory showing us it is still tropical storm. It is forecast to continue to strengthen and we do have the ingredients in the Caribbean to see this become a hurricane as it makes landfall heading into tomorrow in Cuba. And then that'll be its first landfall. Potentially we could see a second of of course, we have to wait, but models are showing us that the system then it, during Wednesday into Thursday, that time frame, early Thursday, most likely will be pushing out into the Gulf. As it does so, though, it'll interact with much cooler waters, number one, and number two, a lot of wind shear. So that'll actually mean that this system weakens. But a lot of the models are showing us that it pushes out into the Gulf. So anyone down from Brownsville, Texas, even into Mexico, all the way into Louisiana, and portions of the Panhandle need to watch this system because we could see potential landfall anywhere in those areas. Is. But the one thing that you don't see is a direct impact for Tampa Bay, which is great news for us. So the system right now continuing to spread out a good amount over towards the eastern portions of it. Another area of development, it would just be low pressure, if anything, and potentially up our rain chances. But right now, no immediate threat, which is great with either one of these areas that I'm watching. But Raphael will move just west and offshore of us, which is great news. It's far enough away. But the outer fringes, the outermost rain bands and gusty winds from Raphael will impact us Wednesday into Thursday. For that reason, we have a weather impact alert day. So the system will then continue to travel away from us and conditions will then return to normal as we head into your Saturday. But just be aware Wednesday into Thursday. I'm talking tomorrow and the next day we could see the outermost rain bands of Raphael. That'll just be moving into our area and things return back to normal heading into this weekend.